In vehicles equipped with the RCD310 uh, stereo system, you can very easily stream Bluetooth audio direct from uh, your cell phone or another Bluetooth device, though generally speaking, of course, it'll be your cell phone as you already have that paired for the hands-free feature uh, for using your cell phone while you're driving. Now, for the Bluetooth audio, you, uh, of course, need to first pair your device. So I've got my iPhone here already paired and set up. To activate your Bluetooth audio, this is a one-time thing that you'll do right at the beginning. You do Menu, Setup, select Bluetooth Audio, and we're just going to turn that on, and now it's going to be set. From there, right, we'll go to Media, and you notice it just says CD. It doesn't show any media. That's because it only reads the Bluetooth audio if you actually have any Bluetooth uh, audio streaming to the stereo system. So first thing you're going to have to do is open your device. Select a track. Start playing. So now I've got a uh, track actually playing. I'll go to media. Bluetooth audio is now visible. And you can hear the music streaming from my iPod. Now, one of the great things about Bluetooth audio is the fact that not only can you play, in this case, you know, the media actually on the phone, but you can also play via apps. Now, my personal favorite is Pandora Radio. It will also support iHeartRadio, Spotify, and several other applications, uh, media applications as well. Now, for that, just like we did with the iPod feature, you just come in here, control it from the phone itself, and now I've got my Pandora radio playing through my sound system. That's the streaming Bluetooth audio on the new Volkswagens. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to contact me. You can contact me through SoCalVWGuy.com or, of course, Facebook.com slash SoCalVWGuy. But it's too much.